Locked up in the Tower of London. I love history, especially when I have a chance to look around dark, damp old dungeons and check out gruesome stuff like torture chambers and... Well, you get the idea. So here I am at the Tower of London. My uncle's a beef eater, one of the special yeoman warders. He's always telling me about the famous prisoners at the Tower, so I've come on a tour to check the place out for myself. If you've never been here to the Tower of London, you might think that it's just one big building. But it's not. There are all sorts of ramparts and structures, gardens and apartments, loads of nooks and crannies to explore. That's a raven. You get a lot of them here. In fact, they say if the ravens ever leave the tower, then England will fall. Good job they look well fed. The tour's taken us here, to the bloody tower. This is where Sir Walter Raleigh ended up. He was a mega famous explorer who found new lands and brought many new things back to England, like tobacco. Although, I'm not sure we'd be thanking him for that these days. Look, there's a globe of the world. It's spinning all by itself. That's weird. I'm going to take a closer look. Whoa! Looks like Sir Walter Raleigh himself. Get in! Dear oh dear, Sir Walter. Marrying someone on the sly? And you, the Queen's favourite too. No wonder you've been punished. Yeah, bad move, mate. The first time he ended up in the tower was when Queen Elizabeth found out that he had married Elizabeth Throckmorton, one of her ladies-in-waiting, and without the Queen's permission. Queen Elizabeth got pretty jealous and so... he ended up here for five weeks. Looks like we've moved forward a few years on. Sir Walter, welcome back. You are charged with treason, seeking to overthrow King James. A preposterous accusation. I've done no such thing. See, Raleigh's back again after annoying a different monarch. But hey, the apartment here in the Bloody Tower has changed a bit. It looks pretty nice. Books and plants, more rooms even. Your wife is here, Sir Walter, and your children. Thank you. Let me please complete this chapter. It's for my history of the world. He wrote a lot during this day, and he certainly had enough time. Ten years. Imagine that. My darling, how well you look. How fair the children. And I mean, to me it looks pretty cushy. He's got his wife and children in the quarters, at least some of the time. And I can see one, two, three servants bustling around him. He still looks miserable, though. Are you sad, sire? At least we have these quarters, refashioned just for us. And you have your physic garden, and the hen house converted for your studies. But I live to explore, not to be caged. I fancy the king has taken pleasure in making this cage gilded. He knows no amount of satins and silks compared to the draw of the sea and the thrill to explore. That I, the former captain of the guard, governor of Guernsey, high sheriff and lieutenant of Cornwall, should be penned up here like a pig at the county fair. Intolerable! My uncle told me that the king knew what a brilliant captain Raleigh was and let him out of the prison one last time to find the fabled city of El Dorado and the gold that was believed to be there. But get this, the place just didn't exist. And to make matters worse, Raleigh's men attacked the Spanish and that could have led to a war. A really bad crime which landed him... You guessed it, back in the tower. This time, there would be no escape. Raleigh was executed on 29th of October 1618 at Westminster. He's said to have a pretty good sense of humour, right up to the end, although he was broken by his treatment. Let us dispatch. At this hour my egg comes upon me. I would not have my enemies think I quaked from fear. And I'm back. The globe stopped spinning now, but I'd better get moving myself. The tour group is moving on. It's hard to work out whether Raleigh deserved his treatment here at the Tower. He might have had luxury compared to many prisoners, but he had lost his freedom. And the monarchy was more than happy to use his skill at exploration and enjoy the things he brought back when it suited them. What do you reckon? I better go. Catch you later. 
Locked Up in the Tower of London with support from historic royal palaces. Find out more at funkidslive.com slash tower.